Enjoy our story by taking control of our tormented main character and leave. Take on. Change various settings in the. Take on the trials once you're a. Start the story from the beginning. Well, sit back and enjoy the strange tale of Catherine. When the night sky fills with glamour, a lovely story <clears throat> awaits you. Good evening. Welcome to the Golden Playhouse. Your guide for the night is me. The Midnight Venus, Trisha. Have you heard about this scary rumor? They say, if you fall in a dream and don't wake up before you land, you die in real life. Tonight's story is Catherine, an unconventional romantic horror. A man with a certain <laughs> curse has a terrifying week. Our hero in this story is Vincent Brooks, age 32. He's an earnest and kind man. But one day, we begin to see him have terrifying nightmares. On top of that, a torrent of sweet seduction swoops down upon him. Mmm. What a playboy, huh? Will he be able to overcome all the blocks in his life? His outcome, hmm, depends on you, viewers. Sorry to keep you waiting. Raise the curtains. Now enjoy the show. Until we meet again. Hey, where'd you go? Snap out of no. it! Were you even listening? Uh, sure. You know, you've been a little out of it lately. Is everything all right? Scans. Hurry up and climb. Who, who are you? Save your breath and start climbing. If you fall, you're dead. I'll die. The bottom of the stage is falling. Use the directional pad to move. supposed to move these things press the a button to grab the block while holding the block use the also on easy difficulty you can use it to give yourself a second chance All right. finding and picking up a mystic pillow if you see one make an effort to get it all right i got it all right i got it don't just push blocks around without thinking about it. They'll collapse, and you can put yourself into a- Collapse? Moving blocks around carelessly can make things- First, try pulling a block to make- All right, I got it. 
through here on a perfect climb of the underground cemetery. So, are you getting anything extra for this? For what? For all this overtime you're doing. Oh, uh, not this time. This time? Do you usually get overtime pay? Well, no, but... So you don't get anything? <sighs> mm. uh. Here, two sugars. Hey, Catherine. Have you ever had a dream where you died? You mean like, where you're in danger? No, no, where you actually die. You're being killed or something. No, I usually do the killing in my dreams. Huh? <laughs> well, that sounds like you. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? Hey, how many years have we been together? Huh? other news, we have more on the recent string of unexplained deaths that seem to be exclusively involving young men. Cause of death is unknown, and while police are investigating accidental causes, foul play has apparently not been ruled hey, out. Hey, change it! The Chief match is on! Said that attempts are being oh, two beers over here! Coming! Catherine keeps telling me how her mother is constantly calling her. She says she's not worried about it, though. totally gonna take it, right, Vinny? And what do you think? So? Who are you betting on? Come on. Uh, you think so too? What else could it mean? I've known you since we were kids, but wow. You. Married, huh? Hey, nothing set in stone yet. What, you don't want to marry your girlfriend? It's not that. I, mean, I love her, but 
I don't think we need to run out and get married. You know, it's it's like we're comfortable where we are. Are you? Yeah, that's what she said. Her job's always most important to her. I mean, you know she's always been the ambitious type, right? It doesn't mean she'll always be like that. That's not what I mean. Besides, you're single too. Hey, I'm still looking for my soulmate. <laughs> I'm not like you. I've already told my girl that I'm not interested in marrying her. And what if you never meet your soulmate? Then I'll never get married. So what? That sounds just like you, Chief. Anyway, did you hear about Paul? He's dead. Paul? Wait. That Paul? He's dead? Yeah. I, mean, I heard he just got divorced, but he looked healthy. It's a complete shock. What happened to him? An accident? I don't know. Apparently his mother just found him dead in his room this morning. This morning? Wait, you mean... Yeah. The mystery death on the news? That was him. Holy shit! No way! You got mail. From your phone, you can check your text mess. You could even reply to some messages. Certain words and actions change. Vincent's words and actions will affect. <sighs> hey, how many years have we been together? Marriage, huh? Figure this. Just change jobs. You got mail. Spam. Challenging the nightmare. Are you ready? Bringing <laughs> up her parents out of the blue? You got mail. I don't feel like going home today. Uh. You're about to go to the next scene. Are you sure you want to continue? 